Hello, welcome to the channel. In this channel, I will cover useful videos. I do different science, medical, and other topics. If you are interested, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Bacteria are divided into gram positive and gram negative. Bacteria cells are known to be rod, cocci, spiral, and other shapes. Gram positive and gram negative bacteria have a difference in the structure of the cell walls. Gram positive bacteria have a thick peptoglycan periplasmic space and plasma membrane. Gram negative bacteria have outer membrane, lipopolysaccharide and proteins, periplasmic space, peptoglycan and plasma membrane. A crystal vial dye color can distinguish both types of bacteria. Gram positive bacteria have a positive result in gram staining when using the crystal vial diet. The result of the strain is purple colored when it is stained under a microscope. Cell walls of gram positive bacteria have a thick layer of peptoglycan. The thick layer color is blue or purple after being exposed to a crystal violet dye. And the layer of peptoglycan is about 20 to 80 nanometer. In contrast, gram negative bacteria contain a thin layer of peptoglycan about 2 to 3 nanometer. Gram negative bacteria cannot retain violent stain after decolored, and its color is red or pink after staining. Gram positive bacteria have a characteristic like cytoplasmic lipid membrane thick peptoglycan layer, tyquic acid and libot, and peptoglycan chain. These characteristics of gram-positive bacteria have a role in bacteria activities. The cell shape of gram-positive bacteria divided into cocci round shape and bacilli uh, rod shapes. Example of bacilli are uh, corn bacterium, cholestridium, listeria and bacillus. Bacillus rod-shaped bacteria can form spores, and these bacteria are capable of causing serious infections. Bacteria can produce endospores, that is long-living cells, and endospores enable bacteria to survive in harsh environments for long period. Cocci are divided into Staphylococcus catalase positive and Streptococcus catalase negative. Staphylococcus catalase positive is divided into coagulase positive, such as Staphylococcus aureus and coagulase negative such as Staphylococcus epidermis.
Streptococcus catalase negative divided into beta hermetic, such as biogen and agalactia. Gamma hemolytic, such as enterococcus and alpha hemolytic, such as pneumonia. There are many gram-negative bacteria, such as E. coli, and pathogenic bacteria, such as Pseudomonas aeruginosa, Chalmedia tercomadis, and Rosinia pistis. These bacteria contain an outer membrane that protect them from many antibiotics, such as penicillin. The outer membrane comprises lipopolysaccharides that consist of lipid A. This lipid A can cause a toxic reaction, endotoxic, when bacteria are lysed. Many antibiotics target gram-negative bacteria such as amino penicillin, urodo penicillin, guillain, sablosporin, anagist, and others. Gram negative bacteria have many characteristics including an inner cell membrane, a thin peptoglycan layer, outer membrane containing lipopolysaccharides, porin, periplasmic space, is layers, flagell, liboproteins and others. Thank you for watching this video and please like and subscribe to the channel.